base rig with the engine. That is super light. Super duper light. We got some extra throttle cable there that we're gonna have to mess with, which is fine. That's a unique throttle. Left hand. I'm a lefty. Feels pretty good. Actually not too bad. Looks like it could be long enough for me. Alright, looks like the harness in a bag. Here's the cage. Set that down. That's kind of cool because that will allow me to kind of rethread that myself. I like that setup. Something easy I could do on my own. Now I've had the mini plane. I've had several Mavericks, uh, Parajet Mavericks. I've been happy with all of them. Yeah, so that would go there, and the other two would match it. Cool. Actually, I don't think it's going to take very long to assemble this. It's in here, yep, there's the prop. Look at that. Look how small that is. I've never seen a propeller that small. A split propeller. That is pretty cool. All right, so we got the cage assembly, we got the prop. Got the harness. This is what I'm concerned about because I'm such a big guy for this model. Uh, the thing I don't like is all this being exposed, especially once you strap the harness on there. I assume the J bars are in there. So this is really close to the mini plane for me in that it's got the J bar assembly already hooked up, bolted in. Cool, cool, cool. That's already done. So I saw another guy had one of these and his came unbolted he had to put his own bolts in so it looks like it may have just been a mistake on shipping but what I think I'm gonna do is make something that will cover that part up like a back plate and then that way I don't have to worry about the throttle getting back here in that starter gear not that it it would but um, just in case now I've got to go out I don't know if this thing comes with a spark plug Oh, that's the prop hub bolts and spark plugs. Yep. Look out for those spark plugs. <laughs> it's like baby spark plugs. What the heck? I've never seen anything like this before. This is really cool. Yep, user manual. And it is in Chinese and English. And it talks about the ignition control wire and these here this goes to the spark plug so that's your spark plug caps that's where the ignition goes and we've got another um, so there's one spark plug I'm not gonna mess with that oh here's the other one so we got two spark plug caps cool and it gives you specifications for the engine um, how to hook up the battery which was, was my big question gives carburetor function and it looks like um, break-in instructions yeah and then maintenance cool that kind of impressed it's more, better than I thought it was going to be. Now I've got to assemble it and make sure everything fits in. But that'll be, like I said, a separate video. It's actually way better than I thought. I was just, I really thought, okay, if this is no good, I can still take the engine off and put it on another frame if I want to. But I'm kind of like the simplicity of all of this. Again, the only thing I don't like is I want some sort of plate here. It doesn't have to be metal, it be plastic, but something to cover this to prevent the harness or anything from getting back in here. I'll have to crank it up and see if that only moves when the starter moves, but again, I just want something to kind of clean this up a little bit, but other than that, I'm happy.